Well, uh, hello friends and soul family. Beautiful rising, good afternoon, and or lovely evening to you wherever you are, depending on the location of your rotation. Hmm. Thank you for stopping by my channel. This is our daily chakra energy reading, and today is Friday, fabulous Friday, January 12th of 2024. I almost said 23. <laughs> Um, so, uh, happy Friday, happy fabulous Friday to all of you out there watching right now. I hope that you are all doing so, so, so very well. All of my readings are intended to be timeless, meaning whenever you have found this video is when you are meant to hear the message. So, if your guides have led you here, your spirit, your ancestors, your higher self, source, all that is, or even if someone has shared this video with you and you decided to watch it, then there is a message here for you. So, tune into your intuition to know what that message is for you. All right. So, happy... Friday, yeah. Happy birthday to all of you um, Capricorns who are celebrating your birthday on this wonderful day. Today, my grandma is celebrating her birthday on the other side. And uh, yeah, so uh, I'm sending shouts out and love to all of you, everyone on this side or the other. So she would have been 91. Woo! So, yeah, so happy birthday to my sweet grandma on the other side. All right, so let's get into our chakra energy. And I just, I don't know, I had a wave of happiness just come over me. Like as soon as I started the video, it was strange. And so, I don't know, I feel like there's just something coming in that's just bringing in happiness for all of us. What that is for everyone is different, but I just felt like this incoming wave of happiness. So, yeah, whatever that means, but it's exciting. All right, what is our affirmation for this lovely Friday? Uh, what do we, what affirmation do we need to know for today? There we go. It took a while. We went through almost like half the deck before it came out. So, okay. So we have the auric field of the etheric body coming through for us with an affirmation today. Um, we've been working on our etheric body a lot. I've noticed that probably within like the past couple months, we've been doing a lot of etheric body work and... Uh, that is the part of the auric field that is the closest to our body, the one, the part that has the physical, the most physical contact, I want to say, with the outside world because it is the layer right, right above our skin. So, card number six. I now completely and lovingly release all of the energies that are not beneficial to my development from my etheric body. I now completely and lovingly release all of the energies that are not beneficial to my development from my etheric body. Yeah, exactly this, exactly this. Letting go, releasing every single thing that no longer is beneficial to our development. That's what I love. Um, I like that it says that specifically, um, you know, all of the releasing the things that are not beneficial to our development because I feel like we also have a tendency to hold on to things whether it's necessary to or not I think just out of habit that we have learned here in this human experience we have a tendency to hold on to things instead of releasing them and when we go through our lives holding on to things we carry those with us from 
you know, lifetime to lifetime because it stays within our soul. So when we are releasing all of that, we are releasing that tension from our actual soul when we're using, when we're using this affirmation and uh, yeah, it's very powerful. So let's read the meaning. I now completely and lovingly release all of the energies that are not beneficial to my development from my etheric body. Meaning, it is always important to very consciously let go of all types of energies that you no longer need. This conscious decision is necessary because there are many little sticky points within you that for one reason or another, which is not really important, want to hang on to the old stuff. If you decide that you want clarity within you, they will lose their power to keep you stuck in things that have long been outdated. You must make this decision very consciously and make it repeatedly for some time afterwards. Otherwise, you will fall back into the old structures. Direct your attention towards the positive new things. Then the negative old things will no longer be able to cling to you. Healing Stone is Rose Quartz. Fragrance Essence, Cypress, cypress <laughs> and Stone Pine together, and the box flower is Pine. So, yeah, absolutely. One thing that stuck out to me the most during this is the mention of conscious. Like, So it's us consciously making that decision and realizing that our default is to go towards the outdated thinking and making the conscious decision repeatedly to release all of those un unnecessary energies so releasing you know all of the energies that are not beneficial to us so you know when we whenever you find yourself in a spot that you know maybe you're thinking of something or maybe you're having an old reaction and it doesn't necessarily feel right to have that same old reaction and so um you know, we have to consciously make the decision of, okay, this does not feel right. Um, whatever it is that is triggering me into feeling this way, I have to release that because it's not for my highest good. So I feel that simply the acknowledgement of that and the conscious thought, that is what makes it so powerful. But we also have to remember that it's something that we have to do repeatedly as well until it becomes natural and normal to us so what a beautiful message for this fabulous friday <laughs> wow i now completely and lovingly release all of the energies that are not beneficial to my development from my etheric body and, you know, as well as the etheric body, you can just leave it as I now completely and lovingly release all of the energies that are not beneficial to my development. So, you know, that is getting rid of all energies, not only just from the etheric body, but from, from any point. So, um, yeah, you can definitely use this to, you know, change up the words to for your highest benefit but yeah so especially like with like the new moon energy yesterday we're still in this kind of manifestation portal where it's like we have the control to let go of what we no longer want or need so that we can cultivate a new brighter more beautiful existence for us whatever that looks like or you know it's different for each of us so I want to thank you all for stopping by the channel today ah yeah here we are like it's like the third year doing this I can't believe we're already almost to the middle of January already like didn't we literally just have like the new year's like I feel like a couple days ago but it's already almost like mid-January it's wild but yeah, things are speeding up. Time is moving quickly so that more things can happen, I guess. <laughs> so I feel. Um, so yeah, thank you all so very much for being here. I love you. I appreciate you. And I will see you all in the next one.